Hey, this is Chad with Monday Scientific, and we're going to talk about some taking your eyepieces out of your microscope head. Sometimes this can be a little tricky, so Mike's going to come in. We're going to show um, on an E200. So these heads are pretty cool. They tilt around, but what you're looking for is this eyepiece we've already loosened, but this one's tight. So if I want to take this one out, it's already loosened, but this one right here, I can't get out. So we're going to take a 2.5 millimeter Allen wrench. We're going to locate this hole right here. I'm just gonna loosen it and then your eyepiece comes right out. So this is gonna be very similar on a lot of scopes. Sometimes this will be a small flathead screwdriver or a different size Allen wrench. So it'll work on pretty much any model. Um, you can lock the eyepieces in if you like. The reason you wanna do that is one, for safety, but two, if the eyepiece is loose and not locked in, when I go to work the diopter tube to focus the eyepiece, I can't do it because it's not locked in. So that's the, one of the main features. So now that it's locked in, I can focus the diopter tube. So that's one of the reasons you wanna um, leave that locked in, or it may be locked in. Another thing, just while we're talking about these Nikon eyepieces, uh, a lot of times you'll be pulling the eyepiece out to uh, look for a piece of dirt that you can't find, and you think it might be on the back of the eyepiece. We recommend, if you're gonna go into the back of the eyepiece, just blow it out with canned air. Do not try to fish around with a Q-tip, specifically in the Nikon eyepieces because the grease fitting on the inside of it, if you accidentally hit it and get it on the glass, it is a real bear to get off. So use canned air, blow it out, or call a microscope service professional to get it serviced if you cannot locate the dirt. So that's about it for this, um, for this video. And if, if it brought you value, please like and subscribe. You can always find us at uh, Monday, mondaymicroscope.com or microscopemarketplace.com. Thanks.